This segment sponsored by Facial Plastic Surgery Center. Welcome back. So if you want to look and feel more refreshed, there are ways that you can enhance your appearance and boost your self-confidence. The experts at the Facial Plastic Surgery Center have a solution that will help you look your best and reduce the signs of aging. If you're thinking about getting some work done, the ultimate goal is to look like a better version of yourself. Don't you agree? Absolutely. <laughs> and joining me today is Dr. Contis from Facial Plastic Surgery Center. How are you? Very well. Always a Thank pleasure you. seeing you. Likewise. <laughs> so let's talk about natural surgery because that is the key, but let's face it, I've seen you know, botch jobs, you know, on television, and people who have too much injectables or work done, and it looks terrible, doctor. I it really does, all. yeah. I know, I see sometimes, um, I go to South Florida to visit my mother and I see some work that's been done and I just want to cry that people look so done and so yeah. bad. Um, and it doesn't have to be that way. The, the sad thing is, is that um, fillers and injectables and surgery were, were made for people to look better. Definitely. Like you said, a better version of yourself. And when you look in, in the public and you see just injectables done poorly and Botox done terribly and um, facelifts with, with the, the skin hanging and pulled funny, it just, it, it scares people. It does, it takes away from you. It does, and you know, the biggest compliment I get from surgical or injectable patients is when they say, nobody really noticed what I had done. They That's just awesome. thought I looked better and they couldn't tell why. And you also provide natural looking injectables. Talk to us about that. We do. You know, um, the injectable companies tend to put pictures out of people who are overdone. Um, overdone cheeks, overdone lips, and then you see disasters in the media. Um, and then you also see movie stars and famous people who've just had too much, mm -hmm. and they look horrible. So, you know, people who are new to injectables are terrified they're, that they're going to look bad. But you don't have to at all. No. These things were developed to make you look better. You know, if you can tell you've had something done, it's not a good job. What I tell patients, and, and what's so important, is it's not the product that's making you look bad. It's the person injecting you who does not understand facial aesthetics. Wow. And you have to understand what is aesthetically pleasing in order to put product where it belongs. Nice. So you can make somebody look better, and you can also make somebody look worse with the same product. Thank you. These are great tips, and yeah. your work, I mean, speaks for itself. You're an award-winning doctor, so if you guys ever want to get some work done, definitely visit Facial Plastic Surgery Center. I love the fact that she's stressing natural. Yes. <laughs> that's what you want. Like yeah, this. seriously. Yeah. <laughs> I'm all for fillers in moderation. Because it I does, agree. it helps you look better. You look yeah. more youthful, fill in those little lines, anything that you're self-conscious about. And it's your life. Do what makes you happy. Absolutely. You know, but why not just be natural? And, yeah. You know, make it look beautiful too. <laughs> That's right. On that note, we'll be right back with our motivational minute. Keep it locked. 